Hello YouTube. So this is a uh, follow-up video to my uh, cover of Olivietti, A Rose for Opona. And um, the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm sure some of you are probably going to end up asking, how did you do it? And what the tuning is. Though I still haven't figured out what the tuning is, but um, how did I do it? What, what are the chords I played? Because you can't really see in the video and etc. that I will show you. So, obviously once you find out what the tuning is, some kind of drop tuning anyways, then uh, what you would end up doing is you start out on a uh, power chord of two. Here, move a bit to this side here so you can see me better. So power chord of two. And then it goes five, seven. And then it uh, does that twice and goes into uh, another chord of three, five, five, one string down from the uh, top. And it's uh, three, five of the first two top strings of that chord, so. Then it's uh, five, seven, seven, uh, and then you move up a string to it's five, seven, four, five. So, sorry. obviously the intro. The next part is just a chord progression as you know and that is the twos. You're doing the same chord of three five five then you're moving up to five five and then you're moving to five seven seven. So next part, I don't actually know, I just went for the closest thing that I could hear and think of, because I'm kind of lazy, and I just used these two main chords, except I single noted them, and obviously because you end here, I just started from there and worked the way down, because it sounded like it uh, went down on it, so... Kind of idea. I kind of missed it at the end there, but you get the idea. So then after that is where you start getting to the single notes. Now this one, instead of doing just the two notes, you're going to want to hold all three uh, notes on two down because there's going to be a hammer off, which is going to be uh, a note that you really need to hear when you switch over to the string above. So it's going to be two, four, five, open, five, one string up. Well, it's not a hammer on. It's uh, just a regular note, I guess. Okay. Then after that is uh, three, five, five. And you're going to use three. Oh, I mean, not three, five, seven, five, one string up, five. So. And that one is five, seven, seven, and it's going to be the exact same as uh, what you did for the intro, and by that I mean it's going to be five, seven, four, five. So, uh, do that again.
least for the whole song now, except for where the uh, middle break, slow down, screaming, uh, breakbeat kind of idea goes on. So, um, that one starts off at 355, then moves on to the two. Then moves up to the five seven. Now the next part I don't actually know, so I just kind of, again, improvise a little. And uh, what I did was between two and three. Then I left a little pause there. Well, the thing did its own little lead, and I went back to the original progression. This is where I did my own little thing. I don't know if it... I really don't think it's original to the song, but it fit along with what the lead was doing to an extent. And what I used was uh, 5, 7, up one string for the 3, uh, the 5 just under it, and the 2 on the string buff, of course, with open. So how it would end up being is open, Five, seven, one string up, open, three, one string down, five, back to uh, one string up, open, two, kind of hammer off into the two, two, four. So. so. That's what I did. So now you know the rhythm for most to Opona. I hope this video helps you because I mean, how much can you really find on how to on Illuvietti? So there you go. Have fun.